right, now um, tell me about New York when when you okay, made my yes. mother do the catering. Oh, yeah. We always what? get we always party down in New York. We like to go. We like to party in New York. Yes, we. I'm love sort of anonymous New in New York. We love New York, and we were shopping. Saying, oh, tell about when we went to Bergdorf Goodman. When we. Okay, one of the times when we went to Bergdorf's. Well, was that did, when we did the MDMA? Yes, in the bathroom, <laughs> on the toilet. Uh, it's like the Sex in the City reboot. Was I put, <laughs> the, you know, the silver stainless steel toilet thing, the flat. So I laid out like little sprinkles of it and we would just lick it and then we'd go. Wait a minute, you made my mother do... Drugs off a toilet? Is that what no, you're hearing? No, the toy the pa- have silver the, the toilet paper thing. Oh, just the toilet paper roll. Okay. Yeah. So no, it's the top. On. No one touches the top. Yeah. Just the toilet paper roll <laughs> in a public bathroom. It was drugs. just the tip. Um, <laughs> so you guys are doing drugs in a bathroom in New York. And then the in Bergdorf Goodman. Goodman. And then we shop for like nine solid hours, right? <laughs> and walk the streets of New York. And I remember there was a guy playing like the um, pail, the plastic pail, and he was bongoing, and then there was another guy dancing, and we were just like, whoa, this is so cool. And you're like, I love this. <laughs> <laughs> and then we did the K. The Keter, the Keter She mean? calls it Keter mean. I know, it's Keter mean, right? Oh, yes. And um, so we were staying at the peninsula, and then I said, hey, Let's do the ketamine. And she looked so good. It was it was February 14th. She had a red jumpsuit on, red lips, her black glasses. And we're walking the streets like aimlessly high as fuck. And then, can I say the F word? Mm-hmm. Okay. And then <laughs> she's, she's like, oh, uh, what are we going to do? And then there was this guy in one of those pedal biking canopy things and he had, was playing like Rihanna or something on Yeah, it. it was Rihanna. And I was like, let's go on that. <laughs> and we're like, okay. So then I go, okay, how much is this? And he goes, it's like $50 and 20 minutes for 20 minutes. And you're like, I have money. Don't worry about it. <laughs> and so we... He took us through Times Square and all the lights and the, you know, the billboards. And he was, remember, he was swerving Yeah, us. he was so fun. He was so fun. He was like a seven-foot black guy from Uganda. And he was so cool. And then she goes, stop here. I want to dance. Ah, yeah. And then what? And then we got out and we danced at our butts off right there in New York City. It and then so fun. there was an ambulance coming and she pretended to freak out, which I didn't know she was pretending. Oh, I was getting way into the drama of New York. She was like, <gasps> like freaking <laughs> out. And I was like, oh no, because I thought you were too high or something. Mm. And I kind of freaked out. And then you go, hi, Macti. And then you started <laughs> dancing again. Do you guys want to watch a, uh, a video? Of what? Of this night. Oh, yes. yes. You guys into it? Uh huh. Yes. All right, give me one second. All right, this is the infamous Ketterman night. Yeah. Here in we go. Times Square. Hey, time is totally wasted. There's no I was way better. I than thought that. you were. I thought you were great. You twerked. What else have we done? Uh, oh, see. you tell well, me. Well, let's see. Other drugs we've done was we oh, did the mushrooms the, in the uh, forest there. Mm-hmm. Where the was volcanic that? forest. The volcanic forest in Pahoa. Mm-hmm. Is that Hawaii? Hawaii mm-hmm. yeah. on the Big Island. Yeah. Yes. I never got to do drugs when I was younger. Yeah. Tell. I was so say. I, you know, I do them with Shannon because like I want to. 
and she things. she feels safe with me. Yeah. Cause so I'm not I, been, I never like... did the mushrooms, but then I did them with Shannon, and we went to the uh, volcanic forest, and it was well, it was just beautiful. It was it? really cool. I didn't really feel anything though. For one minute, I did. No, you felt something, and it was it just felt trippy. We didn't do enough. I didn't want to get too high where shit's dripping, like you know. Yeah. But. Remember, you were in the store, and... Yeah, I saw the Buddha went 3D. A poster like, of the Buddha got all 3D. Jumped out at you, yeah. kind of. Yeah, that was all and I ever... Then I drove home for four hours. So that I was wasn't... trippy. I don't even know how you drove. I didn't really feel much. He was probably like half a block away and took four hours. No. <laughs> right. No, it right. Like That's four hours we drove. I love to ever drive. Have you done mushrooms? I did mushrooms once in high school, yeah. And it was, uh, I went camping Two. with my buddy and um, we were really safe. And I never told you the story, but uh, oh. it was really funny because I <laughs> took the mushrooms and then I started hallucinating. He had really pretty eyes. He had ice blue eyes and I was feeling good. And I looked at him and I was like, you have beautiful eyes thinking like we're a couple bros you know hanging right. out i can be honest he got so scared that i was gonna have like try and have gay sex with him that he ran into the woods and i didn't see him till the next morning he hid from me in the woods thinking i was gonna try and have sex with him that was my oh mushrooms. my god isn't that Poor sad thing. i was just being nice to a friend like you have really pretty eyes you're and so was misunderstood like, eh, whatever <laughs> <laughs> but that was my after that i said i'm never doing drugs again but i loved well, it I loved then mushrooms. we did okay so one of your sons <laughs> Made the the butter. Oh, yeah, the pot brownies. And she made pot brownies. Oh, they were good, weren't they? Well, Shannon couldn't handle it. She only took a little tiny bite of it and freaked I, out like a plebe. And I <laughs> passed out on the ground, and you kicked me and said, <laughs> you, you can't hang with the big dogs. When was this? She kicked me. Terrible. And I had was making linguine and clams, yeah, too. Yeah, I ate that. That's when I I just, that's what passed me out. Like, I, that was so good, though. I think it was all the butter, and I had to poop or something. That's what I remember. Sorry. I'm so glad you brought that up. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, but no, I mean, the shopping... I think it's cool that you're having like a second adolescence because you never did that. You had you had three kids by the time you were like 25 or something. So now you're getting four. The, 24. You had three of us, right? Or four. Four. And then you're like, you got I famous. Never got you got married. Enjoy, no. Uh, this is your, this is your like adolescence It kind of is because like I was a mom by the time I was five. You were like a. Raising my younger sister and yeah. helping out like your, that. Your I was the old, oldest kid, so I. Had to kind of be the junior mom, and I always was ultra responsible, so I never got a party life no, at and all. And then you had to work, and you had four kids, and you yeah. worked. I you worked so I said, oh, my 60s, I'm going to party, and I did. I love that. I want you to talk about that if you could. I think that's such what? a cool moment. Well, just there's a lot of probably older people, older women especially, that listen to the show that have never really Yeah, once done your that. kids are raised, it's time to raise the roof. Get the ketamine up. <laughs> huh? you know, get the ketamine up. Yeah, Fucking do all crazy. that stuff. Well, you know? and your it's kids legal here, isn't it? Yeah. No. Oh, with a, with a doctor's note. Yes. Yeah, uh, you got to go to a ketamine no. clinic. Uh -huh. No, I know. Um, it's it's but proven. it does lift your mood for sure. She said, "I feel so good. It's almost like I feel normal and I can be around people." Yeah, I didn't. I lost fear of like an humans. anxiety. Yeah, yeah, because I have anxiety around humans. But uh, yeah, I think that your sixties and seventies should be all party. I think we should all party our way out. Fuck this hospice care yeah. and that shit dying comfortably. Party your fucking way out. That's why I was glad for your mom. Your mom went yep. that way. She partied her yep. way out to the last day. 